today the topic of discussion is part two of trigger in a previous video we have discussed about what is trigger what was the syntax of trigger and we took one example of salary difference trigger where we were calculating the salary difference of trigger today what we are going to do is going to attempt the next part directly in oracle so what is the next part of today discussion is that what was that trigger and what if we want to update salary of each and every employee by rupees 5000 suppose at the last of an year where increment take place i decided that i'll give an increment an equal increment to each and every employee and everybody's salary will be incremented to 5000 rupees or you can consider it to be a bonus then what is the procedure for doing that so in order to do that first of all we'll make a trigger and which trigger the same trigger which we have created yesterday so let me copy the same trigger for you in order not to waste the time so let me copy the same trigger for you this was the yesterday trigger okay so i'm pasting it over here uh, the trigger was create trigger salary difference before insert or update or delete on amp amp, amp table the about table the about table is amp table having three columns employee id employee name and the salary the first employee is john having salary thirty five thousand, and the last is jasmine having salary again thirty five thousand dollar okay so let me run this trigger salary difference okay so uh, uh, i suggest you to watch the previous video first then you will be able to understand this video very beautifully let me run this video okay so trigger is created finally the trigger known as salary difference has been created and this is created on table m so what what will actually happen over here so uh, we have seen all this uh, yesterday so i'm not going to repeat our entire thing now our task is to our task is to give a bonus of rupees 5000 to every employee of my organization so there are five employees in my organization you can see there are five employees in my organization there are five employees in my organization and i want to give a increment or bonus of 5000 rupees to every employee what i'm going to do i i'm going to do one very important part is that i am going to run this procedure let let me show you the procedure so this is the procedure before executing i'll i'll show you uh, okay i'm pasting it over here then what is the procedure of uh, what uh, declare i took one variable known as tr and data type is number then begin a statement what i'm doing update imp what am i doing is updating imp set what i'm doing setting salary is equal to salary plus 5000 this means i'm not using any kind of clause where clause i'm updating salary of every employee by rupees 5000 rupees by, by 5000 rupees okay then what what am i doing after that if sql percent not found this this is for for if there is no row in a table not found means if there is no row in a table then if there is no row in a table then what do you do then you just simply write dbms dot output dot put line no employee updated because there is no employee in an organization if there is no row if sql percent not found gives you the row number of rows or if there exist any row or not not found means if it is true then this will this will only print no employee updated but what if else if sql found that is there are few employees in our table there are five employees from john to uh, from jasmine from john to jasmine there are five employees in my organization and else if sql found then what you need to do you need to find out the number of rows so sql percent row count will give you the number of rows in my table there are how many rows in my table there are five rows then tr value will be five okay so the value which will written by this particular code will be five now what am i doing is that the what am i doing is that after doing everything after doing everything what i'm printing is that tr that is five employee updated so finally the answer will be five employee updated so how the procedure takes place let me show you the before i run this procedure the moment the moment this line will execute the moment this line will execute update imp set salary is equal to salary plus five thousand so uh, on 
execution of this statement we have already created we have just created a trigger and this trigger is for insert delete or update and what we are doing in a procedure we are updating so the moment this query of procedure will be executed this trigger will automatically get fired and on occurrence of firing of this uh, trigger what will be updated old salary new salary and the salary difference so since i'm giving a bonus of five thousand dollar to every employee then there will be a difference of five thousand for everybody okay let me show you let me show you what exactly happens so let me run this let me run this code this procedure see this see the beauty of this code see the beauty of this code old salary 35000 new salary is 40000 this is for first employee and the salary difference is 5000 old salary 30000 new this is for second employee salary difference is 5000 you can see the salary difference of every employee is 5000 because i have given a constant a constant or a common 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 uh, benefit or you can say bonus to every employee now what happens on execution of everything what is executing see this the last statement the last st statement is five employee updated and you can see the procedure this is what i did in my procedure procedure is that on the occurrence of this what i'll do is that i'll print this line tr tr is what the value of tr is five after that five pipe is for concatenation and this statement get executed as it is so five employee updated and this is very true and this is very true there were only five employee in my table you can see you can see there were only five employee in my table i can show you see that there were only five employee in my table and this all get executed so this was the beauty of this uh, trigger and this was the beauty of the procedure so hope you understood what i'm trying to tell you is that in case you want to update everybody you want to give the bonus to everybody of your uh, of your organization you can you know use trigger as well as this procedure now the second part comes the second second trigger so what am i going to do is uh, going to show you the if else statement if else statement the similar if else statement you have used in c programming java python everywhere the similar if and else statement we are going to use in trigger okay so before creating that trigger let me let me drop let me drop the previous trigger okay so i'm dropping the previous trigger otherwise it will create a problem what is the procedure to drop drop trigger tri tri double g e r trigger then trigger name trigger name is what salary s a l r i salary underscore d i double f e r e m c e so this was a trigger which we have created salary difference let me show you let me show you very quickly let me show you very clear quickly this was the trigger salary difference yeah salary difference we have created and now we are dropping this so what is the procedure what is the query to drop a trigger is you simply write drop trigger salary difference the moment i enter the trigger is dropped now no more trigger is uh, existing with table m now i'm creating an another trigger with the table with table which table imp table so let me copy the trigger for you because i won't waste the time uh, what i'm going to do is that i'm simply copying this, this trigger okay let me copy this trigger control c and then comes control v okay let me copy the trigger okay you can see what i did is that i have created a new trigger salary difference one i have created a new trigger known as salary difference one on on every event either insert or delete or update on which imp table imp table so again we are creating a trip for each row is a row level trigger declare there is a this is similarly this is exactly similar to the previous trigger but i'm using a else statement salary difference number salary difference is a variable and the and the data type of that variable is number then begin statement i'm calculating salary difference what is salary difference my new salary and what was my old salary the the difference will give you the salary difference and now i'm using if else statement if deleting what i'm saying that if deleting then what needs to be print dmms underscore output dot put line and you know in case of delete you use only old old pseudo record i told you i told you yesterday when i told you in a previous video that in case of delete there exists no new value only old value exists so what should get printed old salary suppose i am deleting i employ john so uh, john old salary was whatever it will get printed 
if inserting if suppose i'm inserting a new employee kate i'm an uh, employee kate the new employee is having a new salary so there is a no concept in the case of inserting there is no concept of old so in case of inserting else if what do you, what do you write else if els not els e only else if inserting then what do you do uh, you need to print as it is new salary then uh, this is pseudo record and uh, semicolon uh, colon new dot salary and this is very true if employee is new then it only has a new salary but in case of updating we have everything i'm updating something so this means i was having a previous salary also and now my new salary also so in case of updation there exists everything new salary old salary everything so else if updating then dbms dot old salary also new salary also and what a salary difference also so so on occurrence of on occurrence of insert delete and update the the statement which will get satisfied will only execute okay not every statement will get executed let me run this let me run this trigger for you oh great trigger is created trigger is created very beautiful let me let me show you let me show you uh, uh, the table once again okay so se se L E C T select star from select star from imp order by o r d e r order by why order by i want i want in an order i want in an order to way so first employee is john now what i'm doing i'm inserting one new employee so in that case what will happen only the new record will be updated so what i'm doing insert insert into into table is imp values v a l u e s values i'm inserting a new employee employee id is six okay name is kate k-a-t kate and salary say it's uh twenty one thousand dollar twenty one thousand okay so let me show you will that trigger is executed ah yes this the trigger is executing new salary see that only uh, the the insert statement is having new new see this in is if inserting then only this statement is executing see uh, oh, hope you're getting my point now i'm deleting now i'm deleting so what will happen i'm deleting and delete from delete from from imp i'm deleting this newly entered employee six where w h e r e where 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 id where e id where employee id is equal to six i'm deleting this employee so what will happen see old salary because the new salary was twenty one thousand. now it has been deleted so it will only represent a old salary let me show you what was the case of delete the case of delete was if deleting then only old salary then what update if i'm updating so let me update it for you update up date i'm updating salary of uh, suppose bob i'm giving him an increment of two thousand dollar so update uh, imp set salary is equal to uh, thirty seven thousand thirty T seven thousand where W H E R where E I D E I D where E I D is equal to three three employee ID is of Bob it's of Bob I'm giving him an increment of uh, two thousand rupees what happens see that see the beauty of this code old salary thirty five thousand new salary thirty seven thousand and the salary difference is two thousand and one row updated see hope you understood what i'm trying to tell you so this was the beauty of trigger having if and else statement thank you so much